this lesson, we're going to have a look at how to calculate the area of a parallelogram. The main thing is, first of all, to recognize that we have a parallelogram. And if you look at it carefully, you can see that it's like a rectangle that's pushed over in that the opposite sides are equal and they're parallel, but the angles are not equal to 90 degrees. So the formula for calculating the area of a parallelogram is this one here. The area is equal to the base times the height. But the height is the perpendicular distance or the 90 degree line between two opposite sides. So in this example, we write down the formula first of all. So the area is equal to the base times the height. And the base in this case is 2.5 meters. And the height is the perpendicular distance between the two sides here and here, which is 3.5 meters. Now, before we write the answer down, let's have a look and see why we selected this as the base. We could have selected this one as the base down here, this slope height, but we didn't have its measurement. So we selected a pair of opposite sides that we had the measurement length of, and we also knew what the perpendicular distance between them was. So you'll notice in this diagram, the base is sitting in the horizontal, and we go up here for the height. In this case, the base is along this line here. And as long as we've got a 90 degree line, between two sides and we know its distance, we can use that as the perpendicular height. So our solution here would be 2.5 meters times 3.5 meters, which is 8.75 meters squared. Remember the units for area are square units.